Now, this particular game of the Indian T20 League will feature two teams which are languishing at the bottom of the table, two teams who have an uphill task from here onwards if they are to actually make it to the playoffs of the Indian T20 League's this particular edition. Hello everyone, my name is Shayanto Shengupto and you are watching match number 37's MSP video between Hyderabad and Punjab. My name is Shayanto Shengupto but before I jump into the video, I would request all of you to like, comment and share this video and also subscribe if you like the content. So without further ado, let's quickly dive deep into the video we have in store for you today. Now, if you take a look at the probable playing 11 of both the franchises, then in the Hyderabad franchise, opening the batting will be David Warner and Riddhiman Shah. Though Warner got out for a duck in the previous game, we expect that he will be unleashing his potential in this particular match. At number 3 will be Kim Williamson, followed by number 4 Manish Pandey, and the middle order will comprise of Abdul Samad. Kedar Jadav and Jason Holder. Kedar Jadav will come at number 5, followed by Jason Holder and Abdul Samad. Now, if we take a look at the four bowlers, then it will be in the form of Rashid Khan, Bhuvaneshwar Kumar and the two Indian seamers in the form of Khalil Ahmed and Sandeep Sharma. We know that Team Natarajan has tested positive for the dreaded COVID-19 virus. Therefore, it is either of Sandeep Sharma and Khalil Ahmed who have actually gotten an opportunity. Now, if you take a look at the perennial chokers in the form of the Punjab franchisee, it's a very harsh statement to call them perennial chokers, but that has been their performance over the years. Knowing the batting for the Punjab franchisee will be Mayank Agarwal and KL Rahul. At number 3 will be Eden Makram, who looked solid in the previous game. At number 4 will be Nicholas Poran. So, this will be the top 4 of the Punjab franchisee. At number 5 will be Deepak Huda, though Deepak Huda did not make a mark in the previous game. We expect that he will be performing well. Then it will be Fabian Allen and Adil Rashid who will be forming the lower middle order and the four bowlers will be in the form of Harpreet Brar, Mohammad Shami, Arjdeep Singh and Ishan Porel. Both the youngsters of India, Arjdeep Singh and Ishan Porel played really well in the previous game. Arjdeep Singh took a lot of wickets and all eyes will be on both these bowlers. Now if you take a look at the head-to-head -head battle between the Hyderabad and the Punjab franchisee, then it is the Hyderabad franchisee who have always won won against Punjab on most of the occasions. If you take a look at their overall record, then it is 12-5 in favour of the Hyderabad franchisee. Now, if you take a look at their head-to-head -head battle since 2018, then the Hyderabad franchisee has won on four occasions and the Punjab franchisee has managed to win thrice. Now, if you take a look at the stadium in which this game will be played, it will be played at the Sharjah Stadium. Very small ground, a lot of sixes can be hit over here. The average first inning score in this stadium is 137.6. And if you take a look at the team's record actual uh, chasing, then it will be 5-0 in favour of the chasing team. So, the chasing teams have won on all the five occasions in the last five matches. Now, if you take a look at few of the individual stats in this particular game, then David Warner needs 53 runs to complete 5,000. 500 Indian T20 League runs. Manish Pandey needs 22 runs to actually complete 3,500 Indian T20 League runs. Kale Rahul, who is the skipper of the Punjab franchisee, needs to hit just two sixes to complete 100 uh, sixes for the Punjab franchisee. And Mayank Agarwal actually needs just three sixes to complete 50 Indian T20 League sixes for the Punjab franchisee. Now, if you take a look at few of the player battles, individual player battles, then between Kale Rahul and Bhuvaneshwar Kumar, Bhuvaneshwar Kumar has dismissed Kale Rahul once, Mayank Agarwal and Rashid Khan, Mayank Agarwal in 23 balls, he scored 23 runs against the Afghanistan spinner and Rashid Khan has dismissed him once and on the other hand, David Warner and Mohammad Shami, Shami has dismissed David Warner only once. So with that, we come to an end to this particular MSP video. I hope you like the content. But before I go, I would request all of you to head to our Telegram channel because there you will be getting the best match combos and the best cricket fantasy tips under the sun. So thank you so much, guys, for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel. My name was Shantushin Gupta. I hope you like the content. Thank you.